Daniel Radcliffe is now a dad alongside his long-term partner Aaron Dark. The actor was spotted by a Daily Mail journalist walking with a stroller in New York. His girlfriend was with him, and both looked totally casual. Like it's no big deal that they are now parents. Soon enough, Radcliffe's representative confirmed that they did have a baby. Fans immediately reacted to the amazing news. I feel so old but congrats to them. One person wrote. That wasn't the only comment like that, because everyone still sees Dan as the boy who lived. Fans also jokingly questioned if the actor called his firstborn James serious, like Harry did. And of course, many of them quoted Hagrid's famous line, You're our father, Harry. I'm a what? Dan's Harry Potter co-stars haven't congratulated him publicly yet, but were sure they did privately because they all remain close in real life. An insider said that the Ron Weasley actor Rupert Grint is happy for his friend. When he found out that Dan and Aaron were expecting, he called Dan straight away. Being a father of a two-year-old baby girl, he no doubt had a few tips to share. A lot of people were shocked by the news. After all, Dan only shared that Aaron was pregnant a few weeks ago. But who is his girlfriend and how did their relationship begin? Aaron Dark is an actress, mostly known for her roles in Good Girls Revolt and The Marvelous Mrs. Maisel. Over 10 years ago, she worked with Dan on the set of Kill Your Darlings. They hit it off instantly and soon began dating. A few years later, Radcliffe joked with People magazine that it would be fun to tell their kids how they met. And he referred to an intimate scene they shared in the film. But there was also some romantic stuff. Our characters are meeting and flirting with each other, so there is this kind of sweet record of us just meeting for the first time and flirting. Yeah, that's cute. In fact, that wasn't the only time Dan said something about their future kids. So it's clear that they plan to become parents for some time now. Radcliffe once shared that he hopes that his children will want to work in the movie industry. A dream would be for them to come on to a film set and be like I'd love to be in the art department, I'd love to be something in the crew. But at the same time, he wouldn't want his kids to become famous actors. Because Radcliffe knows the dark side of fame better than anyone else. Although the role of a bespectacled young wizard brought him fortune and adoration, it also gave him a lot of struggles. But Dan managed to overcome them all. And Aaron was the one to help him with many of his challenges. The two of them share a very deep connection. As Dan said to us weekly almost 10 years ago, Aaron is my best friend. He often shares how comfortable they are together, no matter what they're doing. Do, doing the most mundane stuff like uh, just going shopping like with her is just like a joy, like it's fun. And, just like Dan, Aaron doesn't really like the media attention. They don't have social networks and rarely show up at public events. Last year, though, she came with him to the premiere of his film, The Lost City. It was their first red carpet appearance since 2014. So it's no wonder that they also kept the pregnancy under wraps and only revealed it when it was no longer possible to hide the bump. According to an insider, when Aaron got pregnant, Dan was constantly there for her. The actor read many books on parenting and even cooked vitamin-rich dishes for his beloved one to keep her and the baby healthy. So it looks like he's going to be a great father. We wish him and Aaron and their baby all the best.